Welcome back, my friends. It's another episode of Enviroboy Plays. We're playing more Hogwarts Legacy. I'm having I'm having fun with this game. I'm excited to be playing this game. Uh, this game is whimsical, and the Harry Potter world is insane, and I love every bit of it. Um, so let's see here. We were we left off. We talked to uh, who's it over there, Lenora. Nora Everley. We talked to her. Now let's go and talk to this individual who is harassing the cat. Arthur Plumley. Arthur. Arthur, my dear. Uh, I can't quite reach. Oh my god. <laughs> His voice is killing me. Hope they can catch him. This precious child. I'm sure you'll find your way, all right? Oh I yeah! Mean, oh my god. At first. I still get lost sometimes. <laughs> I am losing my mind with Welcome his voice. By the way. Come on, man. Really glad to have you in our house. I'm Arthur. Of course Thank you me. are. What other That's name me. would someone like you have? Your Listen cat? to yourself. No, one of the first years, I think. Don't have any pets of my own, unfortunately. My mother doesn't think too hard. It's like them. especially magical. It's ones. the voice of like a voice actor trying to be an old man who's trying to be a nerdy kid. Oh my gosh. Yeah, <laughs> tend to agree with your mother. Got him. No, hold on. We'll roll the dice. How do we? How are we doing this? Uh, one shame. I think magical beasts are incredible. I'm sorry to hear that. I think magical beasts are rather incredible. Yeah. The thing about coming to Hogwarts: Nifflers, Glumbumbles, Bowdruckles. I thought they were only pictures in books before. Well, <laughs> did bring home a puff skein once. Guys, insane. Furious. His voice is just destroying <laughs> anyway, me. Also, we all have the same glasses. Okay. Um. Uh, have you ever had a pet? Have you ever had a pet, Arthur? No. My mother's a muggle, and as soon as the puff skein that my dad brought home stuck its tongue up her nose, it went right back to the shop. <laughs> well, that's fair. That sounds like a horrible thing. Who would want that in your house? All right, bye, Arthur. Nice meeting you, Arthur. And good luck finding that cat. Yeah, I Thank cannot you. wait. Try not to get lost in the I cannot wait to discuss more things with you, buddy. Oh, man, I love him. <laughs> He's just... Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, anyway. Adelaide Oaks. Adelaide, I wish to talk to you. Oh, Uncle, this doesn't sound like you. Something's wrong. Oh, hello there. You're the new Hufflepuff, yes? Yeah. I'm Adelaide. Pleasure to meet you. Great. Nice um, to meet you too. Oh, I don't know if Is I would say I'm the oh, yes. new Hufflepuff. There's a lot of us, right? We just got this sorted. My uncle. So tell me, I've been hearing all sorts of rumors. Were you really nearly gobbled up by a dragon? Yeah, it was insane. Way more impressive than some dude coming and murdering my family. Although I don't think that's happened to anyone ever. Uh, oh, we gotta roll the dice. Is that, okay? Going. Yes, I was. That one is true. Not the typical start to a new school. That's. Dreadful. I mean. Well, Hogwarts? Uh, well, anyway. It's not really outside the realm of, of possibility. Just day. saying. Um, yeah, is your uncle all right? Are you sure everything is all right with your uncle? Oh, yes. He travels for work. Always busy. I'm sure he just wrote it in a rush. Um, nothing to worry about. That's, nope, 100% Chekhov's letter right there. Okay, nice meeting Thank you. I want to talk more to Arthur. I want to hear his voice some more. And good luck. I wanna, I want. <laughs> okay, do we gotta go talk to Miss Evelay again? Honestly, that's for the best. I kind of forgot everything she said. The Nora. <laughs> he looks a little too humanoid, the owl, the way they designed him. Oh, she does. I apologize. She is likely one of the Hufflepuffs around here. Owls choose their own company anyway. Wait, you're the new fifth year. Quite the dramatic entrance you made. Yeah. I can't imagine one. Yeah, I being brought in everyone will be watching from the front doors like everyone else. Know. Dramatic. Mm. Mm. I don't remember. I know we did this conversation before, but I didn't save it, so that's fine. Um, okay, we're gonna go. With, I'm not worried. I'm really not worried. I'm sure I'll be fine. Nevertheless, it is rather unusual. You what are you insinuating that I'm weird? Rude. Of course, presumably, as a hard-working Hufflepuff, 
You'll prove yourself in no time. I was like sitting there glaring at me. It's like, hey man, I was getting some sweet attention there. And you came over and had to have an interesting conversation. Ruining everything. At least people have always told me so. Oh yeah. I'm Lenora, by the way. Oh, we're finally getting around to names, hey. Well, mustn't keep you. You've such a lot to do. Uh yeah, okay. Do you really think you should have been in Ravenclaw? Well, my brothers were. They both work in the ministry now. I suppose you could say that wit runs in the family. Oh, I was going to say oh, that you must be the stupid daughter. one of the family if you didn't make it in Ravenclaw. Zing! Everyone knows they're the honors the hall. <laughs> the old sorting hat was spoiled for choice with me. <laughs> okay, anyway. It was nice meeting you, Lenora. Of course. Adieu. Bless you. All right, um. Is the new Hufflepuff out of bed yet? Professor Weasley's waiting for them outside the common room. Oh, it's a good thing I'm overhearing rumors about myself to know what I'm supposed to do. Look at all the weird undulating plants. I'm not sure how I feel about it. You okay down there? Are you good? Okay, well, I'm gonna not worry about you. Is there, so like, here's what I'm just struggling with. Uh, and this is just me with every game. This isn't a unique thing to this game. Um, like... Is there, is this game going to, oh, <laughs> oh, they did the staircase thing. Hold on, maybe if we go real, real fast. Come on, here we go, here we go, here we go. Dang it. Oh. Is there a jump? Can I jump? No, okay, children can't jump. Magical children can't jump. Everyone knows. Everyone knows. Everyone knows. Okay, let's, let's go, uh, let's, let's go do stuff. Hello, Professor. Oh. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts. Nope, I've let's do this. this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make but like you only have one first day at Hogwarts. I'm just I'm really now, confused of like situation. I don't know why they haven't sit. given You'll need to catch up with your classmates us. and not fall behind. Like I don't I don't know what my character's backstory is, but like we're not running an amnesia thing, so it's like why don't I get to know my character's backstory? Owls. Yes. Your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. Oh good, I'm glad that that'll be predetermined for me. And the Department of Magical that sounds forward thinking. We've devised something Leave it to the wizarding world to be to ahead of the game in terms of like human rights and all that kind of stuff. Here you are. Is this before they invented mirrors? Have we not really understood the concept of individuality yet? Whoa! little wackadoodle going on here. Is this how every book works in the magicking world? Because that sounds horrible. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth Wow, that looks like a remarkably handy you tool that they should have given to every student and it makes perfect sense that they would make in the magical world. I love that, like, okay, so I'm being ironic when I say this. But also I'm not, I don't know, it's weird. At any rate, I love that within the Harry Potter universe, um, there's kind of this general, like, gentleman's agreement between all people who dip their fingers in the Harry Potter world to not give a single rip about continuity. Like, just like, you know, it's, it's one thing if you have to add a mechanic or invent something for the sake of a game, sure. But like between the books, the movies, and now this game, just, just the consistency of the world does not exist. Oh, just, just search that. I need to remember to use Revelio. I feel like this is going to be my like catch-all, um, like oh, like if you want to find anything ever, just keep spamming R. Don't give me that little like impatient fingers crossed thing. This apple. I'm totally gonna make my character so overweight. And we'll see what the guide says. Okay. Oh. House Elf Recipe Book Guide Pages. Rumored to contain some of Helga Hufflepuff's original creations, this book holds a collection of Hogwarts students' favorite recipes over the centuries. Some dishes like pickled drink, 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 dirigible plums are likely an acquired taste. Cool. Why don't they just have a normal thing like, hey, this is how you make like a chocolate cake. Like, why does it all have to be weird? 
You know, like, that's one of the things I never understood about... Oh, wait, hold on, sorry. You unlock field challenge. Your progress towards completing challenges appears here. Cool. Um, wait, are we gonna open our field guide? Okay. This is your wizarding level. XP earned from challenges. It increases your level and power. I'm gonna be the most powerful! Um, your field guide checks your current challenge progress. Select the challenges menu to... Okay. Field guide pages, exploration, quests, combat. Oh man, they've got percentages. Oh great, we're gonna be playing this till we're at 100%. Better believe it. Um, yeah, field guide pages. Field guides in Hogwarts, great. Each challenge has tiers. Special wars and locks, tiers come in appearance of every great. Rewards must be claimed from your challenges menu. Come back often to collect rewards. Okay, that's, I'm fine with that. But let me stay in there, I wanted to, I wasn't actually done looking at that. <laughs> Wanted to see what's going on. Yeah, what's this? Gear appearance reward. Hogwarts regalia spectacles. I'm gonna be doing that condescending British accent forever, I promise you. I apologize to anyone who that offends. <laughs> I can't not do it though. Oh, we have all our gear though. Um, Gold rimmed, silver rimmed, circular spectacles. Well appointed, stand- what is- oh. Do I no magical- I don't know what- Oh, that's what we have on. We can do those. Yeah, we want to do these. You gotta destroy them! Seems a little <laughs> extreme. I don't know that we need to destroy them. We have handwear. Black leather gloves. They don't do anything. I don't want those on right now. Hi, kitty. Do you want to come be magical with me? Are you gonna bump the microphone? Add a bar. Not a girl. Oh, nope. You're gonna run around. Lots of energy. Okay. Sometimes she just does little drive-bys just to be like, Hey, I'm here. And, uh, hi, I love you. And then she goes. Which is, like, cute, but also... Oh, I kind of love that. Look at that little thing with the hair clipping through. I kind of love the Newsboys hat, though. What do they call it? The dark flat cap. Alright. Oh, yeah, we're 100% going to wear the dark flat cap. Are you kidding me? What kind of neckwear do we have? Look at that. That cut, that's got, I, and Honestly, I, with the hat, honestly, you know? <laughs> I'm having too much fun. I like this game. I like this game. I don't know what other people say. Honestly, I do my best to avoid reviews of games beyond just like, is it generally seen as positive or negative within, you know, groups that are playing it to know if it's like a complete waste of money. But beyond that, it's like, you know, we just kind of, I kind of avoid worrying too much about 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 what other people say about games. So I don't know exactly what everyone says about this game, but I'm immediately having fun. This is so innocent and fun and whimsical to me compared to, especially like, it's really nice. Okay, wait, are these quests? First day out, welcome to Hogwarts. Fired level, okay, yeah, so they've got all kinds of, like, oh, relationships, ooh, relationship quests not available right now. Well, it's, they did. Okay, those main, so all quests, main quests, assignments. Okay, got it, got it, got it, got it. So yeah, that's my like to-do list. Quests, settings, challenges, collection. Oh, we're making progress on our appearances. Ah, additional content. Does, oh, can I not wear these or something? Silver Dragonite Spectacle. I want to wear these. Can I not wear these? The appearance option in the gear menu. Oh, change appearance. In the gear menu. Settings. Um. Hold on. Uh. So what are they talking about in the gear? Like it, it seems like that's what it is. Do it. Accessibility. Interface. Um. No, it wasn't. Oh, sorry, I need to. I need to understand. I want to put on fun stuff. Okay, wait, hold on. So we have a few things here. Hold on. Cosmetic alterations to gear via the change appearance option in the gear menu. Change. Okay. So in the gear, change of... Right, handwork. 
Great flying mounts. Talking about change appearance. Offense. Oh, 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 F, change appearance. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, this is incredible. Hold on, I've got so many of them. Oh, I love all of these. <laughs> okay, all right. Oh, man. Oh, boy. Oh, I dig this. I like this, though. Like, so. Oh, okay. So we can, if there's something that has effects. We can change the appearance. Oh, man. If we can, like, have all of our appearances however we want them to be. Like, honestly, actually, that's so awesome. Because then you don't, you're not stuck with looking completely ridiculous all the time. Rugged overcoat, traditional school robe, arms professor robe, Merlin's cloak. Oh, look at that. That's super fun. Oh, I kind of love that. I, I kind of want to keep wearing my school robes, though. I feel like I want to enjoy being... Or we can just, like, not do it. We can still have them invisible robes. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, I'm actually genuinely really, really in love with the fact that they'll let you just change the appearance of your equipment. You can have whatever bonuses and benefits you you can gain. Right, but, like, not have to worry about looking like a fool oh i genuinely kind of love this is that like merlin's charms oh charms professor scarf. okay gotcha okay no never i guess actually i would rather not have the scarf on um yeah yeah okay oh my gosh okay sorry i'm just i'm i'm immediately having a ton of fun here um what can we what kind of Got perfect, the, oh, prefect. I thought it said perfect vest. Wait, hold on, stylish vest. Prefect vest. Common Victorian garb. Tom's professor. Lilac ensemble. Oh, so we can be our, our friendly Gilderoy. <laughs> oh my gosh, I, I'm, I'm having so much fun with this immediately. Oh, hi, kitty. I'm coming to join us now, for real. I know, you're sitting on the cord. It's going to feel a little weird when you do that. <laughs> I apologize. Okay, so that's so we've got the prefect vest. Was this the stylish vest? I kind of like the stylish vest. I like the darker tie and everything. I'm into it. Yeah, are you saying hi, little girl? Are you saying hi to everyone? I know, my kitty's here. She's a sweetheart. She's having fun being magical with me. Uh, yeah, okay, I want that. Hold on, okay, wait, hold on. I want to look at the eyewear again. I know, we gotta we gotta have the golden... I kind of... <laughs> These are absurd, I love them. I know, they're hilarious. <laughs> kitty's, kitty's chatting with us. Oh my gosh, they're ridiculous, I love it. Okay, you know what, we're gonna save that, though. I am eventually going to be going all out with that kind of stuff, but, like, right now, I kind of want to have, like... A, a, a not entirely ridiculous outfit going on here. I mean, what kind of, oh, what kind of, oh my gosh, we could do Sleepy Boy. It's like, it looks like a little nightcap thing. Oh, what is this one, Merlin's? Oh, Charms Professor Tesseled. The Urchin Hat, is that what they're calling that, huh? The Dark Flat Cap. That's, oh my gosh, these are hilarious. Okay, no, I want to keep the Newsboy Hat on. Um, we're going to stick with that for now. Um. I know. It's so much fun, isn't it, little girl? <laughs> I hope the microphone's picking up her little meows right now. She's doing like she's doing a little chirping meow that she'll do at me some. Okay, so wait, hold on. Can we then change the appearance? Yeah, we Those are kinda cool. They're a little slithering, but they're they're pretty cool. I'm kinda into that. I don't know if they do do they have any benefits for me? I don't think they do. I don't have any benefits. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, you know what? I'm I'm gonna go without the gloves. I'm gonna go without the gloves. I'm gonna go with this. Just we're just gonna add a little newsboy cap. That's all we're gonna add. Okay, sorry. The initial excitement of being able to change my appearance is now like worn off here. What's that? Okay. All right. Sorry. I've got both hands. I got got both hands on the wheel again. <laughs> Driving control. I was I was giving my my kitty little scratches. 
She's a sweet girl. Yeah, you are a sweet girl. <laughs> She's just being so sweet right now. I can't not pet her. I, I apologize. I'm going to make things just a little bit clumsy, but... Good timing. Sure. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Oh, cool. Your so they, we've got our fast travel system. Of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Okay. M for open maps. Oh, okay, cool. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where students and professors live and includes house common rooms and the Great Hall. Uh, okay. But the Great Hall. Uh, yeah. Oh, and then it shows all the other... Okay, in this view, you can see the flu flames available in that region. Green flu flames represent flames you have discovered, including your own house common room. Gray flu flames re uh, reveal the location of undiscovered flames. Oh, cool. Okay. Um, the right side of the map is where you'll find academic points of interest, including the Astronomy Tower, Library, oh, excuse me, and Grin Houses. Like the Library Annex region. Okay, Professor Weasley has unlocked the Central Hall flu flames for you. Use Add to rotate the map and fast travel to Central Oh, okay, cool. That makes it easier to see. Um, okay, cool. Neato, gang. Super duper. And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. Great. Now what do I do? Keep following you, okay. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. And where did you find that remarkably stylish hat that you're wearing? I must have it. I might steal it from you. I might steal it from you. What? No, Professor. I'm uncomfortable with the size of my legs. Haven't we all been there? <laughs> Incredible. to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Okay. Oh, um... So, okay, so I was going to be doing the random dice thing. I don't... So I think for these, these question, when it has this here, I think these are just, like, get more information. Uh, so, yeah. What will I learn in charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes, or terrible. I always thought it was kind of interesting that I they just kind of Professor did Rick. wand work into, like, three categories. Defense against the dark arts. So it's, like, basically fighting... Transfiguration and charms, like those are the those are the three forms of using your wand, and we consider the wand the most important thing, even though you use it for like maybe one third of your classes. Can you tell me more about the defense against the dark? Yeah, it's basically a martial arts defense class, but then you'll also the learn about all of the like evil class. people. Focuses it's like if you had a class in the real world where it's like, okay, so today we're gonna be doing, uh, we're gonna be working on uh, bow and arrow. Um, we're gonna shoot bows and arrows uh, defensively, of course. And we're going also going to tell you about all of the serial killers uh, that ever used a bow and arrow. <laughs> um, what's Hogsmeade? Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all wizarding village in Britain. And is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. It's very alcoholic. We like to get the children drunk in the magical world. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day. And you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Oh, great. Judging I love that they have agreed to give me more work. Earlier, How generous of them. Professor succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My Dragon Attack is sounds like a cool band name. A search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Actually, Dragon Attack, isn't that a Queen song? Pretty sure that's a Queen song. <laughs> awesome. Anyway, um... Oh, okay. Sorry, okay, yeah, let's see. Oh, okay, how often are we... How honest are we gonna be? Oh, we're gonna say, I'm afraid there isn't. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm... Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Good to know. You're a dishonest little twat. Speak of the devil 
Professor Fick. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for me. <laughs> it seems. I, I appreciate that they they well, went with the, uh, they, they're considering the very unclear nature of, of, uh, Belinda's existence that we, that the dice have given us. Path, Professor? Rather unfortunately, like I say, it's remarkably unclear, and you know what? That's okay. Very well. It's all, it's all, it's all part of the air of mystery that Belinda has going on. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. But of course. Good luck today, and remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. Okay. And invaluable to me. As I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, no, you can't copy my Come answers. Me in Not the allowed. After you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. Okay. And we'll see if we can't get you. So can I just like? For those supplies. So so like, can I just go to the classes whenever, or is there like a time? Talk to Professor Fig. All right. Well, hey, Figgy. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today. Before you immersed yourself in studies, did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's intelligence? Oh, is that what we're calling? Just simply saying, like, nope, nothing happened. Um. Oh, okay. Let's see. Uh, what are we gonna say here? I didn't like to lie to I her. I try to evade her questions, though I feel a little deceptive. That said, I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. I mean, it's pretty obvious. A dragon attacks, and it's all just like, oh yeah, no, nothing else to that story. Nope, not a single thing. Where this path we've embarked upon will lead, it may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of, and she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Yeah, don't want to be honest. Uh, Good. I don't want to be honest now, with all of the adults in the world. As you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well trained. What? What? So like, Happily, but this is the thing I don't understand. Like, team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking they're talking so openly about my so magical ability or whatever. So it's not a secret. But why? So why is the game not telling me the player about that? Like, it seems like the the character in the game like all the characters in the game they all seem to be pretty aware of of my magical abilities so why don't i the player get to be aware of them okay this is the main quest okay quest will be locked by spell and or requirements in these cases you'll need to be the required level those can be earned by completing professor assignments or quest rewards okay cool so those things will all just kind of like pop up on the map so it looks like this is going to be a game with a very useful map then Track quest with against dark arts or let's track the let's do the defense against dark arts. We'll track it. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. Cool. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now it sounds like you've quite a day ahead. What with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, yeah. including your own wand. You'll All these kids Mr. are going to be so like remarkably jealous. Of, of Belinda here getting to like go to Hogsmeade just whenever and everything. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More no, than don't tell me what to do. On the magic you are able to master within these walls. Right. Okay. Go to go to class. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, we haven't done that yet this session. I need to do that. Oh, it's a page. I want it. I want it. Yeah, yeah. Come on, that's got to be important, right? That page has to be important. Oh. Look at that. See, okay, so we clearly don't need a wand to cast magic. We can also use a but I want that page. Look, it's flying in circles. It has to be collectible. Oh, I do have a jump. Yes. Wah. Yeah. Wait, hold on. It's going to loop around. It's going to loop around. It's coming around. It's coming around. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, apparently I can't do anything with that yet. Oh, what's the reveal? Oh. What is? 
Um. Okay, so there's something about that. Uh, I don't know exactly what's going on with that, but I'm wondering if we'll, like, learn more about that type of puzzle. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. What's going on with that? I don't, I don't, there's, there's something. I don't know if I know what the connection is. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. No. Okay, I'm I'm gonna just guess that maybe that has something different that I'll need to do for it later. Okay, oh man, the lighting's kind of freaking out on us for this one. That's okay. Oh, we don't have time. Oh shoot, we're we're kind of at time. Okay, I'm gonna get outside of the class. I'm gonna get to the point um, that we're outside of the next classroom or whatever. Good lord, it's the first day and you're already getting howlers? You must be a real screw-up of a kid. This is why- this is why mom doesn't love you. <laughs> oh sweet, why do we have rhino skeletons in here? This is rad. <laughs> Alright, this is- this is fun, man. I'm excited about playing this. This is gonna be a good time. Like a real good time. That where the class okay, that's where the class class is, that's where the quest begins. So we're gonna call it an episode right there. Um I love the the orb eyes. That's unsettling and wonderful and magical and whimsical and great. Um but yeah, so so for now for now I will say thank you so much for joining me. Uh as always, uh, love and appreciate all of you. Uh go um go go stay in school, kids. That's the lesson of this one. We're starting school. Even if you know what, let's do this one. Let's let's expand it a little bit more. It doesn't matter if you're starting late, right? Like if you if like just like our just like Belinda here, starting a little late. Even if you start late, don't be afraid to to go to school and get yourself educated. It's I've I've said it a million times before, no one was ever hurt by being smarter. So don't ever be afraid to do whatever you gotta do to get yourself to be smarter. Uh that's that's my advice today. So go forth and be be brilliant. Uh yeah, so but yeah, love you. Bye. Thank you.